Hey peeps, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope you're well. Don't worry, I'm aware that there is a weird cotton wool ball stuck to my ear. I've recently had my 26th operation and it included some ear surgery and some feet surgery. I hate that. They look disgusting. They look better than they did. It did look like I have boxing gloves on. Anyway, that's not today's video. Today's video, I thought I would show you my May favourite. I know we're into June now, but I didn't have enough energy for the first week as I was recovering from my op. And please excuse the lighting, as I always say in my videos, because I don't have the proper lighting. It's a lovely sunny day again, and I've got the like curtain shut. This orb of light keeps coming back. So I have blabbed on too long, I will get straight into it showing my favourites of me. First up, meet Esther. Yes, I have named my walking stick. I've been waiting so long for an aid to help me with my walking. If I'm not with somebody to hold on to, I usually end up tripping, or actually I trip up anyway when I'm with somebody. So I have been given this by my physio to help me when I'm outside on my own, just to stop falling. Although I have kind of nearly tripped by using this anyway, so I'm still getting used to using using Esther but she has been a great help and may she carry on being that way. As it's plain black um, I think I might put some like skin or tape on it if you can get it. A friend of mine did ask where the Dalmantes were so maybe I should get some gems to stick on it. Now I'm gonna stop waving that about and show you my next one. Oh gosh, is that better? Hello, I've moved it close. Mm -hmm. My next favourite is my MacBook case cover. My mum and dad bought it for me after I helped out with dog sitting for them. They let me choose it online from a site that is well known as eBay. Not sponsored, wish it was. I love pandas and bears, so I thought I would pick this one. It took forever to come because originally the wrong size came, and yeah, that's the whole kerfuffle. Another story. But I love this. Oh gosh, that lighting is awful. It has another casing on the bottom. I love it. It's so cute. Second favourite. My husband and I had our three year wedding anniversary in May and my mum and dad bought us these iridescent, is that the word? Glasses. It's not very clear in the light but when it's well, my it's not gonna make a difference. When when it's full with water or the drink you have in it you can see it. My husband's one is more gold but he wouldn't let me show it so because he's worried I'm gonna steal it. It's a pint. It doesn't look like a pint, but yeah, it is. I love the iridescent kind of rainbow colour at the moment. I've been trying to collect earrings that have that same colour. I'm hoping this will show. At the moment, I have these in. I think this one is a little too big. I don't know if that's going to show up, even if I will show it in camera. But I have bought a rainbow one for this earring, but it's still not healed, even though I had it done in August. So once that is healed, I've got like a rainbow hoop to go through so this one's a little heart hope that is showing up can't see anything i have ordered a smaller one really cheap like a pound or something i'll stop showing what you now because i might gross people out oh, oh this lighting oh. just spent 10 minutes trying to organize the lighting again it's not working i hate this but my next favorite is the spices i've nearly finished them i didn't get these in may i think i got them no i have had them a few months but i thought i would include them in the maid's favourite because they're nearly finished. It's the Nude Spice Sweet and Smoky, um, just a little sample pack. My mum had Eddie and Herbie one which she gave me to try which is also very nice. I have been adding these um, just like on top of my food, just like salt and also into my cooking. And um, this one gives like obviously a herby kind of taste, it's very garlicky. Good. But I prefer this one, um, and this is, yeah, just a very kind of paprika -y, icy, smoky taste. It's really nice. You can get them, I think, in larger sizes from Nude Spice. Again, not sponsored. Wish it was. I got these on something called Sweat Coin, which you can build up points while walking outside. And I spent my Sweat Coin on this, which is really good. I also spent some Sweat Coin on this face mask not face mask, face wash, which is one of my favourites as well. It's, I'm not even going to try and pronounce it, but you've seen it. It's an exfoliating face wash, orange, eucalyptus and witch hazel scent, and it's just 
really fresh zesty smell and I have loved this. It's from Groom if you would like to try it. Also on Sweatcoin occasionally if you want to try Sweatcoin again. That's not sponsored either but I wish it was. I'm going to try and rush this because my battery is running out and this light is doing my head in. I'll just sit like this. I also have been loving these panna cottas. Panna cotta is, does it even say that? No it doesn't. There it is. It's the panna cotta and it's two raspberry and Madagascar and vanilla panna cottas. I bought this from Aldi for $1.99 and it's kind of my monthly treat to have. I just love panna cotta. Panna cotta is my go-to pudding. If there's a panna cotta pudding in a restaurant then you have to have a pudding whether on full or not. And I have also discovered MUA foundation. My mum had this after swimming and she let me use a bit and I was hooked. I get it in natural ivory which is a very pale one. More paler than I thought I would go for but it's really good and I have it on now and it's quite tacky but it stays on a very long time but yeah been loving this one. Random but I thought I would share it. My friend gave me a Tangle teaser and I have been after one of these for ages ever since my original Tangle teaser got stolen um, in the swimming pool. I have loved this because of the long hair um, it's really helped and um, as this is a no-go zone it's also been really handy to like brush my hair this way without it being really painful. So Tangle Teaser gets my number 9 spot, not in order, but that's my ninth favourite. And last but not least, I'm showing a bit of shoulder, whoops, sorry. And last but not least is a film called Life of the Party. It has my absolute favourite actress in it, Melissa McCarthy. She plays a lady called Deanna and her husband at the beginning asks her for a divorce. And after that she decides to go back to college to finish her degree. She ends up going to the same college where her daughter is studying where lots of funny and cringy things happen. It was just a lovely feel good movie with lots of fun in it and lots of laughs. It came out in May I think. I would really recommend that film. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you made it to the end with my rants um, of the lighting, I will get better lighting one day. But if you did enjoy this video, please give it a little thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already and you would like to be. And as always, please comment down below if you have any ideas of what you would like me to do or try um, next in my video. Sorry, I keep twitching. I'm just feeling the heat today. Also leave me a comment if any of these favourites are yours too and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.